Well, it's almost football season here in Texas, but the latest shortage is now threatening to sideline players if an essential piece of equipment does not arrive soon. CBS 11's Brooke Rogers has that story. The practices are just beginning, but football season is already causing headaches for parents like Rachel Goldberger. I've spent the last several days trying to find a helmet. I've gone from store to store. I call tons of stores. I simply cannot get a helmet. That's because football helmets are practically impossible to find anywhere in DFW. The few left at team sports in North Dallas are all size small. It's a frustrating time for you know, us as a business trying to sell things and the customers, you know, they're frantic trying to get a helmet and nobody has any inventory. The issue is a shortage of resin and other parts that comprise a football helmet, and it's affecting every brand all over the country. Other equipment, including shoulder pads and football cleats, are in short supply as well. But the helmets might not appear until September or October. Our order that we placed, you know, a year ago, we're still waiting on um, from the manufacturer. And they just keep pushing it back and pushing it back and pushing it back. Hey, take helmets off. Coach Charles Haley Jr. says the shortage forces him to make adjustments to practices, focusing on fundamentals and tackle free drills. But he says it also robs players of valuable time to acclimate. You have to actually physically do it. You have to be comfortable wearing a helmet. And just throwing a helmet on is not really just an answer. And Goldberger says come game day, no helmet would mean no playing for her son. I want him to be completely safe. So you need a helmet in football to be safe. Brooke Rogers, CBS 11 News.